dynamically. It's not a little bland overall. The new single turbo uh, three liter inline six is very strong as well as the eight speed automatic gearbox. I'm on the road, it feels large, but when pushed, it comes into its own. For a BMW, the steering we have agreed is a little on the numb side and uh, muted in its feedback to the driver. And that changes a little bit with sport and sport plus settings that kind of make the chassis and the steering and the gearbox a little bit more aggressive. But overall, it's not quite the back road hot rod that we've come to expect. So here we are in uh, the new Infiniti M37. I think that uh, this car, in terms of a car that I might have to live with every day, I like it as a place to be while the world's going by. And all of these cars have a, a fairly high Honda drive factor because they've got good power and reasonably good handling. This car of the three, I think, has drawn the least enthusiasm for its handling. It's a car that requires a little more acclimation before you begin feeling comfortable being aggressive with it. It didn't have quite as much grip as the other two cars. The steering response is, is not what I would call linear. Once you get used to it, it's just fine. This car has good responses. It does what the driver tells it, and it tells the driver what it's doing. But again, in terms of their dynamics, the distinctions between the three cars are subtle. We're in the Audi uh, A6 3.0T. Audi was invited back because A6 won last time out. Um, we're just finishing our handling loops in Southern Ohio. This Audi, it's the only all-wheel drive car of the three. Uh, in the rain and in the tight uh, corners in the hills, the car was less likely to come around on you, would understeer fairly early. It tells me everything that's going on underneath the tires. It's uh, got very light steering, much lighter than uh, the BMW or the Infiniti, but it's accurate. However, it's got more body roll than the other two cars, but there's not a, enough weight shift going on that it's affecting path control or the, the arc that the uh, car takes through a turn. This Audi launches so hard out of tight turns and so quickly it has no trouble keeping up with the infinity that makes 30 more horsepower. 